this is the final resting place of Emma Bliss. Now, Emma was a Titanic survivor. Emma signed on to the Titanic on the 6th of April 1912 as a stewardess. She survived the Titanic sinking and returned to England. On the 24th of July 1913, she came to Canada to join her husband and sons. They lived in Davenport Road and in 1932 the family home was in Durant Avenue in Toronto. Her husband Ernest unfortunately passed away in December of 1932 in Detroit and Emma died on the 18th of June 1959 in a nursing home. She was 93 years old. Emma Bliss. Her husband actually emigrated to Canada in 1911. He came with um, their two sons and it was quite some time later that Emma and Amy, who is her daughter, joined them. Rest in peace Emma, Amy and John. I'm in the beautiful mausoleum at Mount Pleasant Cemetery. It's so big. And I'm here to pay my respects to Mary Fortune. So Mary was born the 12th of May, 1851. She passed away March 8th, 1929 in Toronto. She was married to Mark Fortune, who's here also. They had six children and in 1912 they had been on a tour of Europe. They were travelling with Hugo Ross, Thomas Beatty and Thomas McCaffrey. They booked the maiden voyage of the Titanic and boarded as first class passenger. She boarded with Mark and the children Alice, Ethel, Mabel and Charles. The tickets cost them £263 at the time and they occupied cabins C23, 25 and 27. Obviously, you know, the Titanic sank. But Mary and her daughters were rescued in lifeboat 10. Mark and Charles did not survive. After the disaster, Mary returned to Winnipeg and then moved to Toronto, where she lived with Ethel. She never remarried. Rest in peace Mary and rest in peace Mark. Titanic survivor Mary Fortune, now reunited with her husband Mark. <laughs>